Lindsay Nguyen is going to come. She's one of the three of us that put this event on. And this gal has a story. She has a why that I know that some of you are going to be able to relate to. How many of you have ever shouted at the TV in watching this stuff going on? Well, this, her shout turned into action. Lindsay, come on up. Hello. Who are the Freedom Warriors here? Raise your signs up, please. Raise your flags up, please. Why are we here? Let's show them and tell them why we are here. Why are we here, guys? I want to hear story about myself. My name is Lindsay. I'm a single mother, I'm a business owner, and I'm a hypnotherapist. I want to, my life's passion is to make a difference for others, to help change the world. But I don't get to do it right now because the state that we're in right now, because of our situation. I took over a wellness center in February and nothing's happening right now with my wellness center. And it's okay. I was not upset at all. You know, I was being thankful. I was following the rules. I was quarantining. I was doing whatever I can. But up until two weeks ago, two weeks ago, I was sitting at my friend's house and I was watching TV. And you know what happened? I caught myself swearing at the TV. That's something I never do. I don't swear at the TV. Okay? How many of you have done that lately? Yeah! How many of you are angry? Have been angry lately? I was freaking angry. You know why I was angry? Because of the BS that I see in TV. Because of the BS I see in the news channels. I don't trust them anymore. King 5 News, Como News, I don't trust them. Okay? Liars! Yeah. What happened to all of our Facebook posts of all the doctors and nurses? Yeah. On YouTube, what happened to all their posts? Yeah. What happened to our freedom of speech? You guys tell me. Am I living in America anymore? No. I didn't come here from Vietnam, from a communist country, to be oppressed again. Yeah. To be told what to do. Yeah. We are here to tell them that we have our free will and our power to create our lives, the lives that we love. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Nobody get, a, get to tell us what to do. Inslee don't get to tell us what to do. Yeah. Yeah. Don't get to tell us what to do. Okay? We did not vote for Bill Gates. Did we vote for Bill Gates? No. Do we want his vaccine? No. Thank you. Bill Gates and Inslee, back off. Get out. Okay? We are not stupid. We are not going to sit here and do nothing about it. We want to reopen Washington and we want it now. Okay? This is the first of many rallies and I'm waiting. I'm here and I'm ready for many more rallies. Okay? Two weeks ago, after, after I was yelling, I was mad, I told my friend, you know what? Enough is enough. I'm gonna do something about this. I'm not gonna sit here and not do anything. I'm gonna start a rally at the Capitol. And I had no idea how to do it. But I'm gonna do it. Thank you. And here we are two weeks later. I'm pissed. <laughs> I'm not a public speaker. I'm just here to share myself. Two weeks later, here we are, all of us here. Despite all of the riots going on yesterday, Despite the weather this morning, I want to say thank you 
Thank you for all of you who are true freedom warriors. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being courageous. USA! 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 of courage to me is being a little bit afraid and do it anyways. Thank you. I want you to continue to go out there and be courageous. And let them know what we want. Share yourselves on Facebook. Share yourself with your family and friends. And stand up for yourself. You know what? If they're mad at you, if they unfriend you, forget it. You have a greater cause. You're here for a greater reason, okay? We are fighting for ourselves and we are fighting for them, okay? So it's okay if they're pissed off, if they're, it's okay if they're mad at you. They're being okay. I had friends that unfriended me. I'm like, okay, I still love you anyways, okay? So thank you. Thank you for being a courageous freedom warrior. We will reopen Washington June 1st. Thank you. Is she a little spitfire or what? Yeah. Yeah. And let me tell you, that girl knows how to get things done. That, she's got an administrative gift. Wow. Thank you so much, Lindsay.